I am not the center of your attention, or we are not the center of your attention. You are the center of ours, right? That the superheroes, and let's take creativity and, and self-journey as an example, that you guys have that already. In May, we closed our District Leadership Institute. Is the DLI in here? Somewhere? No. No, they're not in here. Well, let's give them a hand for, for not showing up. No, they're working hard right now. They're working hard. So at the DLI closing in May, it's a year-long institute. I was there. There was a guy sitting next to me, James Sokolowski from Milwaukee, gear up. And he said, hey, yeah, that's right. And we were in Dallas. And he said, hey, you know, I'm going out tonight. I'm going to do a little spoken word at this club. And I said, what? And he's like, yeah, anytime I travel, I try to find a place, and I, I do spoken word. So he did it for us at the DLI, 35 school administrators, a gear up coordinator, gear up leader from Milwaukee. So I figured, you know, that's the perfect example to show you what she's talking about exists already within you. So will you welcome James Sokolowski. Excel, prove, mobilize. This is the framework from which our goals will be realized. Gear up calling all superheroes to help our students to start, stay, succeed. College-bound scholars determined to be a success story. Yes, indeed. Leave all your fears, insecurities, disappointments, and distrust. That stuff is for the wind to be left in the dust of the trails that you leave behind as we forever move forward with only your own greatness on your mind. We ain't accepting no will nots, no cannots. Gear up, hit the ground, trying to help you connect the dots of your dreams to your plans so you could bypass all the schemes and the scams that leave so many young people left lost in never never land never ever fam will we steer you in the wrong direction we trying to see you get them big dollar scholarships and plenty of letters of acceptance but first first First, you gotta handle these high school lessons. Understand that from now until the end, your own motivation will be your best weapon. The will to overcome whatever situation you're facing, whether you was placed in, standing adjacent, or just got caught up listening to the wrong station, wasting time on bad decision making. I've been a product of that. Dropped out of high school by the age of 16. I'm from these streets, I'm from these schools, and like so many youth, I broke plenty rules. I cussed out my teachers and vandaled they personal. Was a jerk to my elders and disrespected my kinfolk, shoulder shrugs and meme mugs with frequent responses, got plenty referrals, smoked in the bathrooms and the hallways, always into something, you couldn't tell me nothing, I was ripping and running, playing by my own rules, I'm from these streets, I'm from these schools and I made it to be a master despite all my setbacks, I'm a poor righteous teacher trying to make it so simple and get back to where I came from and to come from where I came from to get where I'm at now, lets me know that there's hope. Even though that broke pockets and potholes rep where I rest at. Milwaukee's my city, let me show you what we best at. Separating the people by race and class. High unemployment, particularly amongst young male blacks. Highest rates of black male incarceration. One of the poorest cities in the nation. One of the most segregated places in the nation. But I believe that we can change all of that. We all can change all of that. See, now is the time to bring it back. I'm from the city of the bucks, and I know everybody likes to get them bucks, but I'm talking about bucking the trends, the stats, and the status quo. So if you're down for that type of bucking, let me know. Gear up, let's go. Word to Jabari Parker. Be in school all day, every day. Pay attention and come prepared, ready to ask some questions. Don't take what's said on face value. Be an inquisitive, critical thinker. That's what this world needs. You are what this world needs, so forget about anybody that ever told you that you can never be the producer of your own truth. Make moves, go to class, get good at math, and get them credits. Understand this whole school thing is just a rites of passage for the life that comes after, and that's the real challenge. And if you want to own your future, you got to walk this earth with the goal to be super dynamite, fantastic. Seek out your interests and your passions now is the time to shine bright. Never be a dim light in the eyesight of people or places where opportunities are awaiting. The world is yours for the taking. And believe me when I tell you that college is one of the best places to find or make your place in, whether certificate, tech, two year, four year, or beyond is something for everyone to be on. So I don't know what you be on, but it's time to be on, moving beyond, just settling for getting by. Can't be complacent with them C's and D's. Gotta be striving for them A's and B's and preparing to slay on the ACT. But let me just say, 
If you happen to go astray along the way, take my story as a testament that it's never too late to switch up the pace, decide to be great, determine your fate, determine to be a success story regardless of what stands in your way, determine to be a success story no matter what you got on your plate. Make your dreams a reality by creating your plans today. Thank you all for having me.